In an effort to boost the economy of Oshun State, the wife of the governor, Irelu Ngozi Adileke, has flagged off an empowerment program for 3,000 businesswomen in the state. Irelu Adileke at the program in Ushubu also promised to empower over 9,000 women, youth, and persons with disabilities before the end of the year. Femi Afari Ogun reports. For three days, 3,000 business women between the ages of 18 to 35 years spread across the three senatorial districts of Osho State are being tutored on how best to boost their businesses. The facilitators of the Empowerment Program, Enterprise Development Center for Atlantic University and Esther Adeleke Humanitarian Foundation, a pet project of the wife of Osho State Governor, Erelu Ngozi Adeleke, are making moves to ensure young women are engaged meaningfully in Oshun State. Aside the wife of the governor registering businesses of all the 3,000 women with Corporate Affairs Commission, she is also giving out grants to boost their businesses. SMEs control the large chunk of the GDP of Nigeria. And I really want to see my women grow their business because if SMEs in Oshun State are booming, are doing well, it adds up to our own GDP in the state. One of the training, we expect that each of the participants will be able to develop um, a workable uh, growth plan. So that is almost similar to a business plan. She revealed that before the year runs out, more people in Oshun will benefit from our various programs. We're not going to technology. It's going to be ongoing, ongoing. Because after this batch, we have another batch for the youth. After the youth, we'll have for the disabled before we round off for this year. Effectively, next year, we'll start all, all over again. We we'll have it in batches. But what we are doing here is to cut numbers that we can organize and take care of at a city. The Commissioner for Commerce and Industry, Reverend Bumijeyo, described the initiative as a giant one that will further complement Governor Adeleke's effort at empowering many youths in the states. This is to change a narrative of joblessness in our society, targeting women to promote them to become a business woman in this society is a great task and is a good in initiative, man. Beneficiaries lauded the effort of the wife of the governor to make life better for them. It's a, for, for women in Oshun, it will eradicate a lot of poverty. We give us breakthrough. Uh, we have learned a lot how to grow our business. We have learned on how to develop our business in many ways. The training for Osho Central was held at Oshobo, while that of Osho East was held at Elisha, and that of Osho West was at Iwo. Femi Afariogun, NT News.